Labor Day, a, a normal, nice holiday weekend for most people, but for this family, it turns into a crazy, eventful weekend that changes their life. Labor Day starring Kate Winslet, um, Josh Brolin, and Gatlin Griffith, and small part by Clark Gregg. Basically, this mom and kid living together, um, and the mom's all like kind of depressed, and this guy, um, this got guy fugitive, um, like basically forces them to like let them stay at their house, and they end up, the mom and him end up falling in love, and crazy stuff happens, and yeah. What did you think of Labor Day, Josh? The movie. Oh yeah. Uh, overall, I thought it was a pretty good movie. You know. Uh, yeah, I mean, overall, I mean, the acting was pretty good. I mean, you know, Kate Winslet, Josh Brolin, you know, uh, you know, pretty good actors for the most part, you know, so definitely, uh, going to expect quite a bit from them, but, yeah, they both did a great job, you know, they, uh, really invested in their characters, and, yeah, I mean, they were just really good, and I obviously hadn't seen the young kid much before, but, yeah, I mean, he did a great job, you know, this kid was great, yeah, I mean, I just love the, the overall acting in this movie, and, like, the flow, and the way they presented the story was, you know, very nice, you know, and also a few, you know, flashbacks here and there showed, you know, uh, kind of what happened to Josh Rowland's character that, you know, kind of got him to where he was now, so, I mean, you know, it's always not nice to see, you know, uh, background information like that. Yeah, so I, I thoroughly enjoyed the film overall, and, you know, you know, beginning to end, it definitely kept me interested, and, you know, I was definitely waiting to see what was going to happen next, and, yeah, it definitely had me glue the screen, and, yeah, one movie I thoroughly enjoyed, I would love seeing again, you know? What about you? I thought it was great, pretty much, I would agree with pretty much everything you said, but, um, yeah, um, the whole movie was was great. It was um very interesting, very entertaining. Um, I definitely had me um basically on the edge of my I didn't really know what was going to happen with the story. Um, and it was yeah very well done. Um, I thought and the acting was great. Kate Winslet and Josh Brolin both great. Um, I think they had great chemistry and um and they're they're both great in as their characters. And this kid never never heard of this guy before, but this kid was was great acting. It was great actor. He did great in the role. And um. And, uh, yeah, at first I, I didn't really, I guess, I guess, like, as you're watching them, I didn't really like the flashbacks, but once you kind of get the whole picture at the end, I guess, I, I, that, they worked out, I, I, the flashbacks were, were good once you saw them all, I guess, uh, still a couple things were kind of confusing with their, a couple things I kind of had some questions about the flashbacks, but, it did, overall the movie was very well done, and it was, it was very interesting and very entertaining, and it was, it was very good, definitely very much enjoyed it, it's, Definitely a drama. Um, there's a couple of lines here and there, maybe more comedic relief, but overall it's definitely a drama. Uh, oh, it's directed by Jason Reitman, who has done movies such as Juno, Up in the Air. What was it Thank You for Not Smoking? Or um, I've never seen that movie, but um. Oh well, yes, yeah, very good director. And a uh, young adult. Um, uh, that's the I can't think of any others, but um. Yeah, um, I haven't seen the other um, one of those ones I mentioned, but most of those movies I really like. Um, very good director overall. Um, uh, I don't think it's really. F I don't think this movie really felt like his. His other movies all kind of like a little, had like a style. At least the ones I've seen had like a similar style. I could feel, but like I don't. I didn't really feel like his style was particularly to me. But it was a little different for him. But it was still very good, and he's a very good director, and I think he did a great job with this still. Um, so yeah, overall, I definitely really enjoyed Labor Day the movie. And uh, yeah, I think if you're if you would enjoy like a drama romance movie. Starring Kate Winslet and Josh Brolin, um, a more serious romance movie, then definitely would recommend to go seeing it. You will, you should have a good time. Not a very, not a particularly, not overall fun movie, but you, you will enjoy it. It's a good movie, very good, very good movie. And Nothing you really thought was bad in the movie. Oh, well, like I was saying, like while seeing it, I guess the I don't really care for the flashbacks. I'm, I guess the only thing I can really say, I mean, I don't think the. It might not be. I mean, it might not be for everybody. I mean, I know some people probably won't 
So we're just more might be into the type of movie, um, the type of movie that it is. Oh, yeah. But I mean, for the type of movie, if you're in the mood for that movie, I think it was a very well done, very very good movie. I can't really think of anything really like bad about it. No. no. Yeah, maybe uh, nitpicking, but I mean, the only thing I'd say is, um, you know, maybe a few scenes here and there seem to drag a little, but you know, I'd maybe. say in a good way though. But yeah, nothing major. Yeah, not, I mean, nothing I can really think of. I mean, it's just it's not gonna be for everybody, but it was very good if you're if you are into it. If you're into that, if you're into what it is, it's it's good, very good movie. Um. Okay, well, I'm gonna go with um. And I'm gonna go for an A minus on this one. Okay. Yeah. I'll say Labor Day gets a solid A. Yeah. So for our days. And so yeah, that's what we think about Labor Day. Tell us what you think of Labor Day the movie if you've seen it in the comments. Like this video, subscribe, and all that stuff. And I'm Scott the Movie Guy. Cousin Josh here. And that's, and that's all, all we got. got.